Say bonjour and welcome back to Close Gecko. <laughs> geckos and today we'd like to talk about gut loading your insects won't we because it's important to feed your feeders and we've got Bubba Chef we've got Bubba Chef Bubba here good boy and we like to talk about important because it's always important for to have the best in your bugs as possible and we, have, and we have Daisy Chef and Daisy Chefs are here as well because it's important to keep your bugs all nice and healthy because all that goodness from the insects go straight into your geckos or lizard or whatever you are feeding to uh, whatever animal it is, isn't it? And you've got a chef hat. And I've got my chef hat on because we are chefing, aren't we? Yeah. We're doing a bit of chefing. But I don't have mine on. No, that's right. I don't like wearing it. No. So, what are we going to do? Cut these all up. So, we're just going to go through what we feed. We've got our roach colony. We've got our cricket colony. Hate them. We've got some, what we got in here? Locust. Like and some jockey. mealworms. Right, careful with the knife. So first of all we like to, right, careful, 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 let me help. So first of all we like to cut up some carrot. There you go, cut from there darling. You do it. Keep your hand from underneath the knife, you don't want you keep killing yourself. If you are doing this with children, do be careful, because they could cut you. That's a bit more. That's lovely. Do you want me to cut them up? Yeah. So what I like to do is cut the carrot up into loads of little bits, just like that. Just we like, like uh, sheffers. Like sheffers. Have you got the uh, food bowls ready? Yep. Sue chef. But make sure we don't spill that water. I'll try not to spill that water. I'll come to that in a minute. Shh. Mm. Oh. So yeah, get the plates ready. We don't need these. No, we keep them. We keep, keep them. We put those to one side. Ah! There's, there's their plates. There's one. Mean the bowls. Plates, bowls. Yeah, yeah. There you go. So there you go. Separate those that pile into each one of them. So that's a lovely bit of carrot for them. That's it. Now we'll keep those ones to one side. Just like that, lovely. So what are we gonna put in next? That one has one, two, three, four, five. Yeah. And that one has one, two, three, four. Tell you what, we could do that one for the crickets then, yeah? So what's next? Um, um we have to the, the greens? Yeah. The so next we get our greens. Up, oh, up, oh, up. Oh. There we go. <laughs> Open up the bag. There we go. Tear some up and put some of that in there as How well. Do you tear it? With your fingers. Just like right, you could do it. Like right, that. That's it, yep. Just crunch it up. You don't have to crunch it up, just put it in there. That's it, a lovely little bit of greens. Because it's important to give them a lovely bit of diet to get all the nutrients and vitamins and all the goodness into your bugs because then that in return goes straight to your gecko and keeps them nice and healthy doesn't it yeah we want fat insects so you, but yeah. lean looking lizards <laughs> yeah and now we have to put these we'll in. do that in a minute because they're only for the roaches so next what we're going to do next got a little bit of oats in there yeah right what we might do yeah okay i'll open it ready okay. ready Oh God, right, we're going to have to stab it. Again, watch your children. Got it. Oh. These are better for the mealworms, really, but we'll give them all something. So you're going to pour some in there for the mealworms. Just a couple little fingers worth. That's it, they'll love them. And now put one of those off-cuts of carrot in there as well. They'll go nuts for that. Do you want these for that? Yeah, put some in there as well. It's not going to hurt. There we go, and a little bit in that one. Lovely. Oh, we can move that so people can see. Look, it's put some in the, the locust. No. You don't like the locust, do you? Mm, scary. So I'll get that, and we'll. There we go. I'm a proper chef now. Ah, We're oh chefing. No. Oh no! There we go. That's all oh there. Chefing. Don't tell mummy! There we go. All oh, bit of carrot for them as well. You are so you were like this. Yeah, you put a bit of carrot in for the mealworms. You went like this. Oh. You put a bit of carrot in for the mealworms. Yeah. That's lovely. Add a bit of that. 
There we go. They can have a little bit too. Just keep them nice and healthy. There we go. That's nice and easy those two have done actually. Yeah. Where, where's the lid? Oh well. Oh there it is. I found it. <laughs> I found it. So what are we up to? Now we, we are going to do these. Is it so the dog biscuits we'll do in a minute. Yeah. Right, so we've got that sorted. Sometimes we give them to the dogs. Yeah. Would they but, do? But Daisy. Baba likes it, doesn't he? So come here. Um, sit. Um, sit. Say, so give me paw. I don't want that one. I want that one. Yes. No, that one. That one. That one. That's it. There you go. And give Daisy one as well. There we go. They're the kitchen they like, porters. And they like treats, but we don't like them. No. They're so. Not for us. Are you gonna? Would you want to put that one in with the roaches? No. You don't like to. I like to put them in little bowls because um, whatever they don't eat, they stay in there. They'll probably take it away anyway and eat it. Mind you, that'll probably be demolished within an hour knowing them. And I'll... Oh, I will. I want to put it in. Go on then. How... Never mind. We've just tipped it in. They'll still eat that. Doesn't matter. Yep. Right. Uh, do you mean to do the cricket? Tip them. We can tip it in though. We can tip it in, yeah. I like to keep it in bowls though. Right, next one. Should we put that in with the crickets? Oh, I don't want to do that. You have to do it. I've got to do that, have I? Yeah, because I don't like doing that. No. No, I'm scared. Right, we'll put that in there. Oops. Don't plan this one through. Tell you what, we'll do your trick, shall we? There you go. Just tip it in. Just tip it in, nearly eat it. It's not like they've got knives and forks, no, is it? Daddy, come here. <gasps> Are they coming out already? Yeah, they'll start demolishing that straight away. I also like to give the roaches some dog biscuits because that bulks them up and gives them a bit of protein. Helps with breeding. Yeah, you could do some. There you go. That's, that's how you give dog biscuits to uh, to roaches. Just like that. And like that. Oh, the dogs are cleaning up the rest. Yeah, there's some on the floor. So, right, they've got their oats. They've got their greens. They've got their apple. I've got wow. the biscuits. What else do they need? Water. Because they'll probably get a lot of hydration from the greens and the uh, carrot and stuff like that. But I like to give them a little bit of water as well. Now I won't put a water bowl in with them because you're just going to end up with drowned crickets, roaches and everything, mealworms, loafers. You don't want to drown, do you? They're no good drowned. So what I like, what we do, if I get you to do this, we pull a bit of that off. That's it, you soak that in there. Soak it. That's it. Now squeeze it completely out. You don't want too much water because you end up getting too much damp in. Give it a good squeeze. And now pop that in with the roaches. So what they'll do is they'll come along and they'll go down and suck the water. That's it, yeah. They'll suck all the water out of that. And just change that every now and then. You can get stuff like these bug gels and gels like that. But I think get one of these from the shop. It's a lot cheaper. A lot cheaper than doing that and then they'll you could just keep each time put it in there squeeze it out and then they'll come up and they'll get their drink from there won't they yeah just like that i want some of that you want some yeah. we'll make some in the morning I've, I've made a bit of a mess with it when bubba's come back so yeah so that's what i like to do to feed our feeders I, <laughs> i've made a bit of a mess but it doesn't matter, does it? Yeah, because you're a bit And mum's probably going to tell me off because I keep ripping up her sponges. Never mind. <laughs> so yeah, that's what we like to do. Now we know Daddy, all the goodness. Daddy, yeah? I want to eat it when it's bedtime really quick. I want to eat it really quick. All right then, all right then. But yeah, we like to, we like <laughs> to give bit, them a good old we feed. We are a bit silly, aren't we? Yes, we are. <laughs> when you get these from the shop, they probably will be fed, but I, what I like to do is um, top them up with a little bit of food, a little bit of um, and when greens and carrot. Get a good meal in them before I feed them off to the um, geckos, just to make sure they've got all that goodness in them. So that all that goodness but goes straight they, to... But how do you cook them? I just, I will have to do that in a pack. Oh, that's what we forgot. I like to sprinkle a little bit of um, calcium as well on them, don't I? do I do it? I'm so forgetful, just a little bit. Just like... Yeah, you got the spoon in there. So just sprinkle a little bit, just over their food. And then hopefully they ingest okay, that, and then the calcium goes into lizards. Always dust your animals as well. Don't you think this is an excuse not to dust your animals? It's Always make sure you do that as well. I think that's enough, darling, though. There we go. And then we put a little bit in with the crickets. Oh, hey, yo, whoa, whoa. Whoa, 
We're a bit silly, aren't we? We chop over. You're it. silly, I'm not silly. We Let's are both far. Sprinkle that in there. We are both far because we drop over everything. Yes. Oh. I don't think I'll ever be a very good chef, will I? Yeah. And so, and it's it. raw. <coughs> so, yeah, do you want to feed one of the lizards? Yeah. So, yeah, we've got all that done, that done. Should we get tic chicken tikka so you can feed chicken tikka? Yeah, with, like, one of these, look. Did you want to do, try the mealworms? Yeah! Oh. Right, let's get, there's chicken silly. tikka, there's chicken tikka. We throw tikka. everything. Yeah, if I put chicken tikka on here with you, yeah, where is chicken tikka? There she is. And I'll go and get the camera so everyone can watch. Oh no, this is a bit of mess. That doesn't matter. We can um, clean it up. That's what we've got the kitchen porters for. Bubba and Daisy, they'll clean that up. Yeah, Daisy. So I'll put that there Bubba. for you. Okay. Like that. Where's the tweezers? Because yeah. you don't want your fingers no, nicked, do you? Bubba's eating it. That's all right. No, I let him do. Where have I put the tweezers? There you go, Bubba. There you go. Where have I put them? Oh well, they'll do. Never do. Use that for now. I reckon Freddie's been at them, hasn't he? Yeah. So right, if I open that, I'll put that down there. Hello. Where's Chicken Tika? And then I'll get everyone so you can show everyone. Hmm. Oh, there he is. There she is. Have you found uh -huh. her? Yeah, look. Do you see that head? There she is. Yeah, right. Now if you try and pick one out, do you want a hand? That's it. Oh, let's see, pull this back so you can see her face. There she, there she goes. And Another there we one? go. All that goodness is going straight into that little one. Isn't that good? Another one. You do another one if you like. There, the roaches are all coming out already. There she is. There we go. She likes it. Doesn't she just? And now we know all that goodness is going into them, don't we? Yep. One more. One more? Okay, we've got, we've got to feed them all every way after this, haven't we? Oh, oh, I can't see. Has she got it? Yep. Yeah, she got it. All right then, darling. That was good, wasn't it? So, yep, yeah, once again, thank you very much for uh, watching. I'm not sure if I've got this right because the cameraman's off. Well, lady, wife, mum. Thank you for watching. Uh, she's at work. She's at work again, yep. Yeah. Please like and subscribe our channel. It's the first time I've said that. I keep forgetting. And I uh, hope you enjoyed this little episode. And uh, yeah, we'll see you again. Bye. You can see that. Oh, that's two actually.